Hi there, Adita Lang from aditalang.com and today's workout is going to be a little bit of yoga. We got to get ourselves centered, balanced, so we feel really, really good for the week ahead. Are you ready? Now here's the goal. The goal is take this workout or yoga experience that you're going to do and combine it with a little bit of cardio and then maybe even choose another workout video of mine and put them all together so that you have a full day's worth of full body workouts. It'll really serve you good and you'll feel good, you'll feel re-energized, it clears the head and it's got all sorts of other benefits too. So please enjoy. So are you ready? We're gonna get ourselves centered. We're gonna bring our hands right here and first we're just gonna focus on our breath. So what I want you to do is inhale and exhale. And what I want you to do is listen to your breath. Inhale and exhale. One more time, big deep breath and exhale. So take the arms down and we're gonna inhale all the way up. And as we exhale, we're gonna fold down to the floor. Keep your hands on the ground and you're gonna step both feet back and you're gonna lower your body down to the floor. There we go. And we're gonna pull up from our chest. Abs are in really tight, feet are back, big deep breath. And then you're gonna curl your toes under and exhale and you're gonna push your hips back to the sky and press it back, awesome. There we go, now we're gonna walk forward. There we go, big deep breath. And as you exhale, you're gonna slowly roll back up and come back up to standing. So we're gonna do that all over again, you ready? Big deep breath up. And exhale, fold down to the floor. Inhale, step both feet back. Exhale, lower yourself to the ground. Inhale, pull up from the chest, curl your toes under, exhale and push back. There we go. Now, inhale, walk your feet to your hands. This time you're just gonna come up halfway up, inhale, exhale, drop it down, and inhale, come all the way up to standing. Yes, and we're gonna do that one more time. Ready? Here we go, big deep breath. Exhale, fold down. Now inhale, pull your chest up just a little bit. Exhale, come back down and step both feet back. Press it down, lift your chest up, big deep breath. Curl your toes under and exhale, pull that back. Here we go. Now take your right foot up, deep breath, and exhale, bring it forward. You're gonna set it down and we're gonna come down and stretch right here. It's my favorite stretch. They call this pigeon. It's awesome. Get your hips out, all stretched out. There we go. Yeah. Now, are you ready? Take those hands back in again. Big deep breath, curl your back toe, pull yourself back again, and come back to downward facing dog. Now, left leg goes up, inhale, and exhale, bring that down, and take that back down again. So you can either sit here or work your way down wherever you feel comfortable. Oh, getting the hips all stretched out. You know, it's great to be young and that you can just like bend like, you know, Missy over here. My cohort, Mila, we love having her in class. She makes my world so special. Are you ready, Missy? Okay, ready? Hands out, big deep breath, curl your toes under and push yourself back again. There we go, big deep breath. And as you exhale, walk your feet in. Now inhale halfway up. Exhale down and inhale all the way up. This time hands to the chest right here. Ah, okay, so here's what you're gonna do. We are going to stare at something in front of ourselves and I want you to take your right leg and grab onto this right ankle and you're gonna bring it right inside your inner thigh. This is called tree pose. Now keep staring, one thing, keep your eyes on one thing, bring your arms right to the center and hold it there. Mm. Now you can either leave your hands here or you can bring them up wherever you feel like you have the most balance and control. There you go, full inhale, full exhale. That's it. And then bring those arms back down and set that foot down. We're gonna do the same thing with the other leg. So bring that leg up, abs are in, you're staring at one thing. Either hold the hands here or take them up and you've gotta breathe. You've gotta to continue to listen to the sound of your breath. There we go, full inhale, full exhale. Ah, and now bring those arms down. 
and press that down. Okay, so here's what we're gonna do. You're gonna keep your right foot forward, your left foot is gonna go back, and your left toes turn to the side wall. And we're just gonna kinda lean in here. They call this warrior. Both arms are gonna go out, shoulders are down, and you're just leaning into it, big deep breath. And exhale, so we're gonna take this back arm, big deep breath, and as we exhale, we're gonna pull it all the way back, looking up towards your other arm. And then bring it back up to center. There we go, big deep breath. Now as we exhale, take both hands down on either side of the foot, come down, and we're gonna step that leg back up on the toes, and we're in a lunge. Hold it right here. Now drop the back knee, and you take those hips and push them a little bit forward. You get that right in the front of the hip flexor. Take both hands inside the leg, and let's come down either on your, either just bend your elbows or come down on your elbows wherever you can. Now this other knee, I want you to start to pull it in towards your body using your breath. You got a full inhale, full exhale. Both hands back inside the mat, big deep breath. Exhale, come up in that lunge. There we go, hands on either side. Step both feet back. You're gonna lower yourself down, pull that chest up. There we go, curl your toes under, big deep breath, and exhale, press back. There we go, good job. Now, inhale. And as you exhale, walk your feet in. Inhaling halfway up. Exhale down. And inhale all the way up. And bring those hands back to heart center. Whew, well done. Okay, so here's what we're gonna do next, ready? Find your focal point, that thing that you're staring at. Take this right leg, and this time I want you to try to grab onto your big toe. Left hand can go right at your waist, keep staring. So now you can either stay here or you can try to pull your leg out without falling over. You just gotta keep staring. Take it wherever you can take it, okay? Oh! And now bring that leg back in, there you go. And take that down, we're gonna do the same thing on the other side, concentrate. Find your focal point, we're gonna bring in that left leg, grab the big toe. Try to keep the big toe when you extend. Lift up from the chest, breathe, breathe, breathe. There you go, and bring this in and take that down. So, let's bring this other leg in front, turn this toe sideways, and we're gonna lean into it. So, front leg is bent, shoulders are down and back, abs are nice and tight. Now, big deep breath, take your right hand and exhale, bring the right hand down, and pull that arm up and over, looking up towards the fingertips. That's it. Big deep breath and exhale, come back up to center. And now take both hands one at a time, bring them down on either side of the foot, turn yourself, and you're in a lunge. Back that foot up, there we go. Now, both hands come inside, right here. Big deep breath. You can either stay here or you can work your way down. Drop that back knee, there you go, push those hips down. Yes. And this time, come up into the lunge again. And I want you to set both feet back, drop the knees, and sit all the way back here. So we're gonna come down to the floor now, okay? Okay, so now let's take our right foot, we're gonna cross it on the knee. Arms come up, big deep breath. And as you exhale, try to tilt your body like a straight line though from your shoulders to your tush all the way down. You'll feel that right behind the leg. There we go, now inhale, come up and exhale, come down again. Hold it there. Now let's pull this knee into our chest and I want you to turn to the right, turn the other way, as much as you can, that way. Look out the window, look out the window, there we go. Lift up your chest high, abs are in tight. Yes, full twist. When we twist through our spine, we actually energize it, did you know that? You get nutrients in it that way, it's so important. And bring it center and we're gonna switch legs. So cross the other foot on top, Arms come up, big deep breath, and exhale, pull forward from the chest. Keep those arms up high so they're up with the body. Here we go. And now bring that up. We're gonna pull the knee in and twist this way. Chest is up nice and tall. Full inhale, full exhale. There we go, and bring it center. Take both feet together. Now, big deep breath. And exhale, pull forward from your chest. You want to feel it go straight through those inner thighs. Oh, mine are sore. 
Hold it there. There we go. And so now, here's what we're going to do. Cross your legs. Take both arms out. Okay. Right arm is going to go underneath the left. And then you're going to pull both arms up like this. There we go. And we're going to hold it here. We're just going to stare straight ahead and focus on the sound of our breath. Stretches out the shoulders. It opens them up. Full inhale, full exhale. One more breath. And now we're going to let that go. We're going to unwind. So now guess what? The other arm has to go under. So now the left arm goes under, right arm goes on top, and we swivel around. Good. Now sit up really tall. Shoulders are back and down. Full inhale, full exhale. There you go. And bring that down. And we're going to do some lying down stretches. So I want you to lie down this side of me. We're going to go this way. There we go. That's fine. Both feet are going to go up. And we're going to grab onto those legs and press them down towards ourselves. Keeping your tailbone on the floor. Press that down. There we go. Heels to the sky. Awesome. Now, take your left leg to the floor. Left leg all the way down. Right leg is up. We're going to pull that leg towards ourselves. And now we're going to let that go. And I want you to take it out to the side, the other side. And pull it towards you again. Hold it here. There you go. And now let that go. And now cross it over your body and pull it in towards you. Flex that foot down. Not all the way. Keep that leg up high. There we go. Hold it there. And let that go. So now the other leg. It goes up. Pull it in towards you. Now take it out to the side and pull it in towards you just a little bit. And now cross it over the body. Pull it in. Abs are nice and tight. That's it. And bring it center. Both knees into the chest and hold those here. Yes. Sometimes we just need a good stretch. What can I say? We're going to take both arms out. Okay, now you're going to push your knees over to the left. There we go. That way we both go on the same side. Keep the shoulders down. So your opposite shoulder stays down so you can feel the stretch go through your lower back into your hips. And then you're going to take a big deep breath. Legs come up and bring it over to the other side. There we go. And again, opposite shoulder stays down on the ground. Abs are in solid. You're, the goal is to look over the opposite shoulder so you get this whole stretch throughout the spine. And then bring that back up to center. Pull the knees back in right here. And here's what we're going to do. Take your left foot to the floor. Right foot crosses on the knee. And we're going to reach in and pull those legs in. There we go. Awesome. And let that go. We're going to switch sides. Cross that other foot in. Press that all the way in. Hold it there. And let that go. So let's come up to seated. Okay, here's what we're going to do. You're going to close your eyes. Okay, abs are nice and tight. And we are going to actually listen to the sound of our breath for a few moments here. So just full inhale and full exhale. Every once in a while when we got so much going on, it's so important to just take a moment to have no other thoughts run through our head. So if we can focus on something such as our breath, that ends up helping. And so I'm going to guide you right now through one of my favorite brief, quick, easy to do meditations. Okay? And what you're going to do, close your eyes again, put your hands there. There we go. You are going to inhale through a count of four. So you're inhaling one, two, three, and four. Now you pause. And you're basically holding your breath for a count of four, three, two, and one. And now you're going to exhale through a count of four, three, two, and one. And now you're going to pause again through a count of four, three, two, 
and one, and we're gonna do that again, and inhale through a count of four, three, two, and one. Hold your breath for four, three, two, and one. Now take that exhale for four, three, two, and one. And again, hold your breath for four, three, two, and one. And slowly open your eyes. So anytime you can take your mind away from like the big picture of everything that you're doing and kind of narrow it down and focus on one thing, be it the sound of your breath or counting to four, or even a coloring book really for that matter, you end up then coming back to the big picture with clearer eyes, feeling refreshed, and it's a little mental reset, which is really good for all of us. So hopefully you will take that little tool that I've given you and use it throughout the day whenever you feel like you need a little time out, and combine this class with other classes of mine on my YouTube channel or any other type of class or program, and combine it with some cardio, really important to mix it all up. Have a great day, bye for now.